け翼俺がこの試合のキーパーソンだ Hi guys, welcome back to Ike Tsubasa. This is TK, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic day as usual. So, today we are here to bring you the character analysis for Dream Collection featuring Mario Goethe. So, let's get on with it, EK! Mario Goethe, key person in Germany's progress, is an agility type German player that is part of the Rising Sun Germany team. This is the first gacha version of Goethe that is able to play as either attacking midfielder or forward. Goethe is only given 3 hidden abilities, which is rather disappointing as recent Dream Collection players have more. First off, Bond plus 3% with 4 or more European players. This Bond might be the best we had ever seen so far, due to its requirements compared with other Bonds that are 3% or more. Defender Killer grants him an additional 15% stats against defenders. And lastly, Stats Handicap Resistance, providing 20% debuff reduction solely for himself. Goethe does not have a relevant team skill as per Dream Collection standards. His passive is Super Sub, a massive 50% stats boost when played in the second half or extra time. This means that you won't be benefiting from his bond during the first half as he should never start the game. His main skill, Circle Pass, kept at 440 momentum that requires 220 stamina, is a very much needed S rank pass for other versions of Goethe. His other default skills are S Piercing Shot and A Quick Step Fins that comes with a 2% foul chance. Goethe is a super sub, so his base stats were always going to be low, but for some reason he came with a 8k technique. Once again, Goethe is given an excessive 6.8k shot and 5.5k power, which is not necessary since Goethe does not have a good S rank shot. The rest of his stats should look relevant after applying his passive. We suggest going for the All Out Enabler build, 25 to All Dribble, Pass, Speed and Technique. For those that have access to S Pinpoint Tackle, you can consider going with 16 Dribble, Tackle and 18 Speed. Further limit break should be spread out between Tackle and Intercept. We feel that Shot and Power are not worth investing in unless Gutter gets a better S Rank Shot in the future. Let's take a look at his parameters when Gutter comes on the pitch after half time. Both his in match dribble and pass are very impressive, at 15.6k and 16k respectively. Assuming that he is up against a midfielder, his circle pass hits 70k force and quick step feints at 72.5k. If he matches up with a defender, this figure improves to 77.5k and almost 80k respectively. Looking at the figures, it suggests that Goethe can easily win matchups against defenders that are weaker in either tackle or intercept. We suggest replacing A Quick Step Fins with the S version, drop him as Pinpoint Tackle and as Forcible Interception, or the A version depending on your access. If you already have invested in S Pinpoint Pass, consider replacing Forcible Intercept with it. This will improve Goethe's chances against special skill blockers. Goethe's main role will be to enable goal scorers, but without the trendy high baller ability, he might not be as useful as we think he is. He is definitely not a real goal threat, with his shot hitting only 74k even if you limit break his shot and power. And we do prefer super subs who can make a greater impact on the game, scoring goals, like the past Dream Collection Natureza or Asia Qualifier Aoi. So having a super sub dedicated to enabling seems excessive. Since there are the likes of Christensen, Raphael and other enablers that you can start from the first half. However, Goethe's dribbling capability is much more superior when compared with Christensen and Raphael, so he does have that going for him. Goethe ran away with 3 stars with us giving him the benefit of doubt. 
considering his bonds and how he could dismantle some of the meta defenders. On behalf of Ikits Basa, I would like to thank all our members on Patreons and YouTube. Your support is very much appreciated and it motivates us to keep the channel going, making more videos for everyone. Alright guys, do check out ways to support us or at least take a look. Links provided in the video description. Check out some of the videos listed here by YouTube. Subscribe if you have not. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys have a great day ahead. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye.